Hi, I'm Daphne Richards and this is Augie. Recently, we asked viewers to send us their summer favorite plants and we were overwhelmed by the response. We received so many great choices that we couldn't list them all in one week. So we're continuing with your great recommendations today. Helen Sorison O'Dowd Quinn from Navasota loves Texas native star hibiscus, which is normally red. And Marianne Yevington Hutto loves the same plant, but she lucked into a white one. Heidi Schaub likes Salvia Gregii, one of my favorites. And Jeff Ferris adds Texas Sage, also quite commonly known as Cenizo, to his list. Another showstopper is Lisa Lapasso's choice of Fireman's Cap Coral Bean. Duranta is top with Laura Sammons, and Esperanza rates high with Sharon Nixon Nettlebutt. Duranta and Esperanza together make a nice color combination. And Jenny Stocker's pick, no surprise, is Rock Rose, which would make a lovely smaller shrub near those two. Vines also made the list, including Passion Vine from Curdy Code, Jana Cara, and Vicki Blockman, who also likes Sestrum. Annual Moonflower is Karen Curry's pick, good even in a container, placed near an entryway, of course, to sniff and view at night. Kathy Kloba values her butterfly blue clerodendrum, and Martha Merrill Chang loves her pass-along purple-leaved canna. Kirk Walden likes ground cover ice plant. And in the vegetable garden, Randy Jewart and Joe Summy go for okra. David Brooks for sun gold tomato, and Katie Proderowski for black-eyed peas. In part shade, firecracker fern is tops for Stephanie Collins and Martha Cray. Donna and Mike Fowler also favor that one, along with Pride of Barbados, Rock Rose, and Red Yucca. Another great suggestion for part shade to sun is Turk's Cap from April Thomas Rose and Sharon Black Green. Phew, I think that about covers it. It was great to see so many of my very own Facebook friends, many of whom I only know because you've connected with me there, respond to our request. I'll definitely steal a few of your ideas to fill holes in my own garden. And be sure to connect with us on Facebook to watch for future chances to get involved. In addition to all the great viewer suggested faves, Helen recently sent us a picture of her fall blooming yellow Lycoris aria. Thanks, Helen. We'd love to hear from you, too. So please head on over to klru.org ctg to send us your questions and plants from your garden. Mm -hmm.